Hello, beautiful souls, it's almost like they've been procrastinating on it. That's really the energy I'm getting from this person like they've been. Putting it off now with the herent. Reversed, there's something really non-traditional or unconventional going on here so this person themselves may live a very unconventional lifestyle. There may be something unusual about them something that stands out about the way that they live or work this also could mean that there's something really unconventional about the two of you coming together so if you were to fully come together it might break with tradition or convention this could also speak to if the two of you came together there may be someone who has to separate from their own tradition from their own conformity this also could even literally be someone having to divorce or separate from a particular long standing relationship if the two of you were to come together again there's just some kind of break with conformity here here and i see that with the queen of cups card coming out here but in the reverse position i see that for some divine feminines this masculine may be kind of triggering some of your dark feminine energy at this time and that might be why you are feeling the need to separate from them or feeling a bit frustrated wanting to particularly refocus your attention away from this person and situation and back on your goals because it's almost like this person may have triggered some frustration or anger or apathy that we tend to associate with dark feminine energy now when i speak to dark feminine energy i don't mean dark as in bad eye mean dark as in the shadow aspect of the divine feminine the counterpart energy to those lighter aspects dark feminine energy is actually extremely powerful and it may even be this triggered energy that's pushing you into that chariot into that self focus breaking through barriers breaking through obstacles really refocusing yourself in an incredibly powerful way on your dreams and goals at this time and again part of that refocus may even be partially triggered or motivated by the way that this masculine has triggered something within you again it might be that dark feminine essence or energy it could be something else that they've triggered within you but it's almost like they've given you a newfound sense of refocus or clarity as you desire to refocus back on yourself and away from anyone or anything that is not approaching you correctly from an energetic perspective there's something here about going back to your roots with the three of wands reversed and this is sitting really really heavy on the third eye and i immediately heard dreams so i actually posted on my instagram recently about some of the collective particularly the divine feminine collective which i tend to channel for more dominantly part of the collective recently has been having really profound and highly meaningful i almost use the word symbolic but that's not really entirely energetically accurate here because these dreams they are just symbolic and i'll get into that in a minute from divine muscular type yes if you believe my beloved love i wondered if this was going to come up in the reading i'm feeling a shifting into the meaning of these powerful meaningful that's the word that just keeps coming out like these dreams are meaningful experiences so again i feel that on the whole these meaningful dreams will resonate more so with the divine feminine polarity although of course always take the messages as they resonate they may connect with you as a divine masculine as well but i will say the reason i didn't want to use the word symbolic to describe these recent dream experiences that some of you are having is because they're actually more real than most could wrap their minds around from a conscious physical physical human perspective when i say that they're real i mean a lot of you are having dream experiences where you are glimpsing into alternate timelines i also call this sometimes collapsing out old timelines others of you are having dream experiences where souls from your past who are still energetically connected and bonded to you even if you haven't spoken at all or communicated at all recently in the physical 3D world these souls from your past are i'm hearing 
lost. Soul's air coming back to you in consciousness potentially through your dream state essentially connecting with you on the astral plane in order to receive some kind of subconscious. Download healing guidance from you at a spiritual level you could think of this in a somewhat metaphoric way, almost like you and your dream state being akin to a spirit guide for these lost souls that come to you. It's like just like with a spirit guide typically you aren't able to visibly see the guide but you can sense the guidance and it almost feels like the guidance is coming from within yourself from within your own subconscious mind but from another perspective it's really you connecting with this external spiritual energy or guidance well these dreams are the same way it's like you are in the spirit realm connecting with the spirit the soul of these others through their dream state of again these feel like people people who and this could just be one person it could be multiple people these feel like people who have taken a path i wanted to call it a very karmic path so it might be very karmic for some of them who have taken a path that's very out of alignment with their true soul purpose or who they really came here to be for some of you these may be people platonically or romantically who at one point were very much aligned with you on the same timeline the two of you may have been very much in the same world dimensionally speaking you may have run in the same social circles you may have dated at one point you may have been connected in some way but i'm hearing there was a 